Welcome to Learn Accounting, where we explain everything in accounting. In this video, we will be looking at the history of accounting and how it has evolved over the years up till year 2023. It was Thomas Carlyle that said that in every phenomenon, the beginning remains always the most notable moment. And so, we would like you to sit back and enjoy this history lesson. It is true that accounting is as old as man. Accounting has been said to have begun a very long time ago. Let's have a look at the timeline of accounting history. Around 3000 BCE in ancient Mesopotamia and Egypt, accounting first originated as bookkeeping, which involves obtaining and recording business transactions. Early forms of accounting emerged to track and record economic transactions. Clay tablets and papyrus scrolls are used to record financial information. In 1494 CE, a Franciscan monk named Luca Pacioli was an Italian mathematician who published the first book on double entry in the city of Venice. He titled the book in Italian language as Summa de Arithmetica, Geometria, Proporzioni et Proporzionalita, which includes the first known written description of double entry bookkeeping. The double entry system has since then become an important tool used largely in accounting. Hence, he is referred to as the father of accounting. In the 1800s, the Industrial Revolution brings significant changes. This is because before the Industrial Revolution, most production was done by hand using simple tools. But during the Industrial Revolution, there were advancements in technology, such as the invention of machines and the development of new manufacturing processes. This led to a change in the business landscape, leading to the growth of corporations and increased accounting needs. In 1887, the American Association of Public Accountants is founded, becoming the precursor to the modern-day American Institute of Certified Public Accountants. In the 1930s, the Great Depression led to the need for standardized accounting practices. In response, the Securities and Exchange Commission is established in the United States, and the Committee on Accounting Procedure is formed to set accounting standards. In 1949, the Institute of Chartered Accountants in England and Wales is formed as a professional accounting body in the United Kingdom, providing guidance and oversight for accountants. In 1973, the Financial Accounting Standards Board is established in the United States to replace the Committee on Accounting Procedure to assume responsibility for setting accounting standards. In the same year, the International Accounting Standards Committee is formed to develop a set of international accounting standards, later known as International Financial Reporting Standards, IFRS. In 2001, the Enron scandal reveals major accounting irregularities and corporate fraud, leading to increased scrutiny and calls for stronger accounting regulations and ethics. In 2002, Majorly in response to the Enron scandal, the Sarbanes-Oxley Act is enacted in the United States to enhance corporate governance, internal controls, and financial reporting transparency. In 2005, the International Accounting Standards Board replaces the International Accounting Standards Committee and introduces IFRS, a globally accepted set of accounting standards used in many countries. In 2007, the global financial crisis had huge implications worldwide. This is because financial institutions packaged subprime mortgages into complex financial products known as mortgage-backed securities and collateralized debt obligations which were sold to investors. As the housing market began to decline, borrowers defaulted on their mortgage payments, causing investors to lose their investments. In 2014, the International Accounting Standards Board issued IFRS 9. This is partly because the global financial crisis of 2007 revealed weaknesses in the accounting treatment of financial instruments, particularly in relation to the recognition of impairments and fair value measurements. IFRS 9 aimed to incorporate lessons learned from the crisis and strengthen the accounting and reporting standards to address these deficiencies. In 2021, as the rise in the need for companies to disclose information about their climate and sustainability-related activities became increasing, the IFRS Foundation announced the formation of the International Sustainability Standards Board to develop and issue sustainability-related accounting standards. The ISSB will act as a sister board to the IASB. The standards issued by the ISSB are called IFRS Sustainability Standards. 
On the 26th of June, 2023, the ISSB issued IFRS S-1 titled General Sustainability-Related Disclosures and IFRS S-2 titled Climate-Related Disclosures to become effective from 2024 upwards. Other ongoing developments as accounting continues to evolve alongside technological advancements, such as the use of artificial intelligence, automation, and blockchain in financial reporting and auditing processes. The timeline explained provides a general overview of the history of accounting and does not include every significant event or development in the accounting field. Leave your thoughts in the comment section about any other event you think is relevant to the development of accounting. If you have enjoyed this history lesson in accounting, hit the like button, subscribe, and share with your friends and colleagues. See you in the next lesson. Cheers.